Okay, here is the um, solution to question one of the practice problems for 1D kinematics. Uh, so question one, we have a car accelerating from 5 meters per second to 21 meters per second at a rate of 3 meters per second squared. And we were asked to find how far it travels while it is, ex while it is accelerating. So the first thing we should probably do is write down all the information we're given. So we're given uh, the following. We're given the acceleration, um, and I'm going to assume the car is, well, it's traveling in one uh, dimension, so let's just say it's going in the x direction. The magnitude of the acceleration is 3 meters per second squared. Our initial velocity is 5 meters per second, and our final velocity is 21 meters per second. Now we're asked to find um, displacement, or rather how far it travels. So what we are interested in is finding delta x. Now the thing to note here is that this is motion with constant acceleration. So let's write that down. Motion um, with uh, there we go with constant acceleration. All right. Now, um, this is just a kinematics problem, and there are several equations we have for motion with constant acceleration. The one we're going to use is the following, that the final velocity squared is equal to the initial velocity squared plus 2 times the acceleration times the displacement. Um, in this equation, we know the final velocity, the initial velocity, and the acceleration. Uh, the only thing we don't know is delta x. So we can solve for delta x. Delta x is just the final velocity squared minus the initial velocity squared. Or well, I say velocity, but I should really just say speed. Uh, divided by 2 uh, times the acceleration. And it's just now a matter of plugging in all the uh, given quantities that uh, we have in the problem. So we have um, 21 meters per second squared minus 5 meters per second squared divided by 2 times the acceleration which is 3.0 meters per second squared. Okay, uh, all that's left to do is plug the, this, uh, all these numbers into your calculator, and uh, the answer you should come up with is 69 meters. And uh, that is the solution. Note, the original question was given to two significant figures, and I have expressed my answer in, uh, two, uh, with two significant figures as well.